He is serving a life sentence in prison, but today the U.S. Department of Justice says former attorney Alec Murdoch is facing almost two dozen new charges. A federal grand jury has charged the 54-year-old with bank fraud, wire fraud, money laundering, and other charges. There are 22 in all in this new indictment. The indictment accused Murdoch of directing others to send attorney's fees right to him rather than appropriately routing that family. money through the PMPD law firm. It also accuses Murdoch of intercepting insurance proceeds that were intended for beneficiaries, but depositing that money in his personal account. It also showed in some cases he then sent money orders to family members, including a $75,000 money order to his father. Now, in a statement, U.S. Attorney Adair Burrow said trust in our legal system begins with trust in its lawyers. South Carolinians turn to lawyers when they are at their most vulnerable. And in our state, those who abuse the public's trust and enrich themselves by fraud and theft and self-dealing, they will be prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. All right, in other news tonight, Murdoch's lawyers, Dick Harpulian and Jim Griffin, have responded to these new charges, and they say, quote, Alec has been cooperating with the United States Attorney's Office and federal agencies in their investigation of a broad range of activities. We anticipate that the charges brought today will be resolved without a trial. Murdoch, of course, is serving a life sentence in prison here in South Carolina for killing his wife Maggie and his son Paul. Now we're going to have more on these charges coming up tonight on News 19 at 6.